Hello, I'm Ying Ying Li. I joined the Department of Economics this summer. I'm from Taiwan. I received my PhD in Economics at the University of Wisconsin-Madison in 2013. Then I worked as a postdoctoral research fellow at the University of Oxford. So my current research is about welfare analysis when we only observe income in categories or discreetly. Especially uh, right now is the beginning of these academic years. Um, I would like to think about the welfare effects of a tuition subsidy or what happened to the students if they receive a fellowship. How will that affect their decision to attend college or how will that affect their welfare? Uh, so in my research, I developed a tool to estimate these welfare effects of the price change. For example, I used the Indian teenagers' uh, decisions to college as um, empirical examples. Uh, in that case, we think about a hypothetical tuition subsidy that will decrease the tuition from 700 rupees to 50 rupees. Then I look, I analyze um, how the decisions will be different under this tuition subsidy. So first of all, I found that the probability of attending college is increased. And I also found that from the welfare analysis, giving them this tuition subsidy will be equivalent to increase their household income by 10 to 13% with 90% confidence interval. Especially in this data set, we might not observe income continuously. But from economic theory, we need the income to be continuous. But from the data restrictions, we only observe data discreetly. Then how do we utilize this discrete data or interval sensor data to estimate the welfare effects accurately? That is my research problem. And why do I choose UCI? Uh, the Department of Economics is definitely in one of the top-ranked programs in the United States. And uh, are, my colleagues are very interested in my research. I will look forward to more cooperations with my colleagues and other social science in social scientists in the university.